Mr. Speaker, as Republicans bicker behind closed doors, the deadline to raise the debt limit draws closer and closer. If we fail to act in time, interest rates will skyrocket, the dollar will plummet, and the stock market could collapse. That's unacceptable. It's time to bring this manufactured crisis to an end. But let's not fool ourselves. Even if the Republican leadership does manage to pass a last-minute extension, the mere threat of a default will inflict real damage on the American economy. Economist, economist tells us that the 12, 2011 debt limit standoff cost American jobs and contributed to the downgrade of the U.S. credit rating, and we are repeating the same mistake today. That's why the true threat to our fragile economic recovery isn't our budget deficit, it's a leadership deficit that exists within the Republican Party. Unfortunately for conservative Republicans, irresponsibility has become a badge of honor and recklessness a source of pride. Mr. Speaker, the American people want leadership instead of brinksmanship. They want cooperation and compromise instead of deadlock and dysfunction. Let's raise the debt ceiling and move on to the critical work of building a stronger and more prosperous nation. Thank you.